A man in cuffs, not saying much, as he was taken into custody by the FBI in Allied Gardens. As 10 News reporter Michael Chen found out, stunned neighbors woke up to this this morning when agents had their guns drawn. The quiet of an Allied Gardens neighborhood interrupted this evidence van in front of this house as FBI agents raided the home. We don't know what's going on. You're watching Angelica Carbajal's Facebook Live recorded after the early morning commotion that woke her family. The FBI agents with guns drawn everywhere. Shouts about a search warrant and later the search itself. Vehicles tagged, tents set up to sort through the evidence, bags and bags of it, including electronics like this computer and Carbajal's video. Agents spotted trying to hammer open a safe. More than five hours after it all began, this man handcuffed and brought out of the house. Neighbors say he was recently in a car accident and lives in the home with his parents. What you do, ma'am? What you do? He wasn't answering our photographer's questions as he was put in the van. On the evidence van, a logo for the Internet Crimes Against Children Task Force. The FBI says the search warrant remained sealed, but did confirm based on the evidence collected. One person placed under arrest. It's scary. You never know. It's uh, speechless. Michael Chen. The task force says they are assigned more than 100 local cases every month. The cases they investigate range from manufacturing and distribution of child porn to arranging meetings with children for sex.